All right, guys, welcome back. We're on our second half of the journey. Everything's packed up. We're on the move. Raining outside. Hi, camper! <laughs> We've got these guys in the back now, unfortunately, so less space in the car for anything, even though we got more crap to pack along. All right, we'll just see how this goes. Welcome to the Kramer Family Adventures, where we travel here, there, and everywhere. Good morning, campers. We are in South Sioux City, Nebraska. Over there across the river is Sioux City. Iowa. This just happens to be the campground on this side. Got in late last night. No oh, people say they're cold this morning because someone was hogging all the blankets, even though she says she wasn't. But I don't know. No one wanted to sleep on my side. I had two blankets all to my own. Oh well. Rockney was right. sleeping over there. He was. Oh. You guys making it to the river? It doesn't look yeah. like a river. It usually looks like a beach. Will we see how the water's moving? Yeah. River. It looks like a beach. Well, if there's sand over here. I don't know that it looks like a beach when the sand's up here and the water's way, way down there. Oh, they do have a little bit of a beach, huh? Okay, I see what you're saying now. Be careful, it's not moving too terribly fast, but we don't want to get caught in it. So it'll just pull you and pull you. It doesn't look fast, but it looks pretty. Yeah, it doesn't look too fast, but it probably is moving pretty quick. Yeah. All right, so quick stop this last night. Nice camping along the river. There were some fireworks and whatnot going off and the train every two minutes. But well, we are loaded back up, chugging our way west, uh, kind of north now, but then we'll go west here in about an hour. So, oh, the humidity is starting to pick up. I think we'll make it. Sorry if it's 
it's windy. Because we're in South Dakota and there's like wind all the time, nonstop. But we are at South Dakota's 1880 town. Claim to have some stuff from uh, Dancing with Wolves. One of my most favorite, probably, of Kevin Costner movies. Landed on our camp spot. What do you think, Eggsy? Is it good? Bad? Ugly? Uh, good. Good? Okay. Just uh, be careful in the the netting, okay? That's holding the gra new grass spots. Yeah, just don't trip. All right, I guess uh, time to get our camp set up. Yahoo! Good morning. Angel and I are awake. As you hopefully heard, it rained pretty good last night, multiple times. Whew. Sounded cool. <clears throat> looks like. Oop, looks like the awning. Got some heavy spots we're gonna have to get some water off. Have to disperse the poles a little better. But one unicorn awake. Boy. But pretty nice camp spot. Over there is a little creek. If you can hear it stream.
Good lessons. This morning. Custer State Park. Hello. That's where we're staying. Hello, we got a uh... hi campers. <laughs> we're checking out the visitor center while we're here as we do the wildlife scenic loop. Maybe oh. there's a this morning. Here. Hopefully, we we'll see a buffalo or something. We saw one lone buffalo yesterday. It's pretty cool. it was earlier. A goat. Not close. Alright, we're gonna go check out the bison center facility. The uh, last guy said they had just opened up recently. It says where all the bison info is. We haven't seen any yet. So maybe we can find out where they're at. Let's see what the, what's that do? Push a button. Oh. Oh, it runs. Oh. Wow. What's that? What's that? Prairie dog? What is it? Like a groundhog. <laughs> it's a prairie dog, but yeah, sure. Push that. What's that say? Bellowing bulls. Oh. Oh man. Let's see. that? You feel it? That's what it feels like in the summer? Yeah. That's what it feels like in the winter. Extra shaggy. Keep them warm from the snow. Yes. Yeah. That's the way there's snow. Yeah. That's the way there's snow on. What does that mean? That means we're going to be able to go see some donkeys and buffalo. He said they're down the road where we haven't or we didn't come from. Even some prairie dogs, I think, too. <laughs> so, every September, I heard earlier, they do a roundup, which is some of the information that was in there, checking on them, make sure everybody's healthy, the herd's healthy. When they get too kind of overpopulated, they do sell some of them off to different places across the country, it looks like, based on the map inside. So that's what all these uh, pens are for. On staff cowboys. Uh oh, oh, there's poop on the ground. Ew, ew. ew, ew. Yeah. All right. Like. Let's get back to the car. Keep driving so we can we see some. We don't eat see poop. some buffalo. We okay. Don't eat poop. We don't eat poop. Nope. All right. Let's go check them out.
seahorse statue behind us. Right? Yep. Pretty cool, huh? Yeah. Windy out today. Yep. Feels good though. What's in there? A fire. Some fire. Some seats. There's only one. Arrows. Pillows. Mm. Yep. Mm. Hey, go stand next to Kuya so I can take your picture. What it's supposed to look like. All right, so we're back from our morning of Custer State Park, which we're staying in, but we just did the wildlife tour. And <laughs> don't worry about the sticker bushes. And then we went and checked out Crazy Horse Monument, which is pretty cool. They've done a lot of work in the last couple of years. Um, and I think that we're gonna get a lot done. Now that uh, they're really working on it hard, but the kids have been talking about this stream like it's so far away, literally our camp spot. The stream, it's right here. It's a nice, uh, nice noise all night. Can be heard. Unfortunately, the loud camp at the moment, the Forest Service is, uh, or the Park Service is mowing. Wednesday must be mowing day in the middle of the day. So, oh cool, what'd you find? I don't really know. Stick it in the water and wash it off. Okay. What There's a frog that? around here earlier. What is it? Yeah, a frog. Like a, or a toad, I guess, maybe more. No. Hang on here by the creek for a little bit. We just ate lunch. I don't know. And then know. plan is to go check out. Oh, no, it's just keto, it's Brush more later. Is it quartz? That's what it looks like. Quartz? Yeah. Here. Here. Alright. She's gonna hang out for a little bit still. So. Yeah, I think I said that, but we'll Mount Rushmore later. As long as it doesn't Why rain. It got cloudy all of a sudden here, so we shall see.
All right, so we went to Mount Rushmore, and I'm glad I didn't take this because I'll try to put in a couple of pictures before this of the extent of what we could see. And I kind of worried that once we were really getting some thick clouds as we drove up here. Um, but we pretty much couldn't see much. Only catch a one or two presidents at a time as some of the clouds would clear off here and there. And then uh, hope for the best, but even that wasn't too great. So, all right, back to camp we go. Hopefully, the other uh, two got food ready. Good morning campers. Here we are. Chef extraordinaire. Hello. I got sausages fresh from Indiana. And some hungry hungry hippos over there or unicorns. Two unicorns. How was it? Well, your eggs are already gone. Anybody want some ketchup? Yeah, you already finished the Oh, yummy. What's up, Green Flower YouTube? She got powers. And I'm a superhero. Oh, yeah, okay. <laughs> Alright, so we decided to come back to Mount Rosemore today. Definitely a good choice. Yes, cloudy, but not the fog that we had yesterday. Actually, see the presidents as we were driving in. So, it should be a way better experience. So, we'll post some more updated photos from today's trip. way and not come and check out they're just South Dakota thankfully a motorcycle rally is not going on now apparently there's Camaro rally or something going on in town but I haven't seen any Camaros yet and uh just gonna go check out the they're just motorcycle museum hall of fame and gift shop Alright guys, so we had another eventful day, thankfully we were able to see Mount Rushmore before we left, we got nice and clear today, because uh, we got cloudy again this evening, looks like it probably will rain again on us tonight for the third night in a row, last night wasn't too bad, that first night, really uh, thunder and lightning and booming and 
Last night it was just a little light rain for a little while. Hopefully tonight it does rain. Some light rain again, but tomorrow's a go home day. Well, I say go home, but we still have some places to see and things to do before we make it home, but giving ourselves a couple days to get there. So, thanks for watching. Like, subscribe. Stay tuned to the next uh, video of maybe some of the things we'll see on the way home. Not sure yet. So, talk at you later.